Hi, this is Austin with Josh's Frogs, and here I'm going to be talking about uh, some of our reed frogs. Currently, we have two species of reed frogs, the blueback reed frogs, Heterixalis madagascarensis, and then Heterixalis uh, albogutatis is the other one. Those are the starry night reed frogs. Reed frogs are generally a fairly pretty frog. Um, these specific ones are from Madagascar. There are uh, African mainland species, and most of those are in the uh, Hyperoleus genus. Blueback reed frogs are typically this nice white cream color. They can have varying amounts of spots. The one that I have in my hand right now is a female. The way that you can tell the, whether or not they're a male or female is by flipping them over and gently pulling their legs away from their body. An adult female has eggs that are visible right where their legs close against their body. And males have visible vocal sacs. So from all of the calling that they do, uh, they basically stretch out their skin and they get a, one large stretch mark on their throat. And you can see that on this guy right here. This one is a little bit discolored and red. Oftentimes they are a cream color. With starry night reed frogs, again, that's Heterixalis albucutatis. They have this really, really nice black coloration overlaid with a bright yellow. Um, again, this is most likely a female. Yep. These guys are very, very hyper, so I don't ever recommend taking them out to handle them uh, as they can get away from you very, very quickly. As far as husbandry goes, it is essentially the same. Uh, you can cohabitate the two uh, species of reed frogs that we have here uh, at Josh's Frogs, but we always recommend to try to prevent them from breeding if at all possible, because there is some evidence that they can hybridize. You essentially keep them over water uh, with some cork and pothos is our plant of choice, but you can choose any sort of plant that likes to live in aquatic environments. Uh, Spathophyllum is another one. Uh, again, reed frogs are some of the more colorful frogs that we work with, and they vary in pattern. So if you like diversity, reed frogs are probably the frog for you.